Hello, television viewers. My name is Nick. Thank you so much for joining me once again on my channel. Nick is spelled N-I-C-K, by the way, and not N-I-K, as the Starbucks barista thought. This is Perry. You've seen him in my vlog where we went to the beach like a full year ago. Do you remember Hi. that day? This way. Hi. Hi. So I don't know if you've looked at the calendar lately, but I look at a calendar almost every day. It is fully October. The biggest holiday of the year for people who like weird shit. It's definitely Halloween. So yes, it is of course my favorite holiday. It's not just a day, it's a full month. So today we are going on a Halloween shopping adventure to Halloween Spirit, one of those Halloween costume shops that just kind of pop up every year around this time. Perry and I went to one of these Halloween stores last year and we had a very frightening experience. I remember it being very stressful with lots of things jumping up and popping out at you. Shut up. I'm not about that life, that kind of bothers me. Hopefully we won't have more of the same in this trip to the Halloween spirit. My goal is to find items that will be fun to open up and play with here on camera with you guys in future videos throughout the month of October. I already have another Trader Joe's Halloween cookie house. If you remember last year, I started making Halloween videos in September and one of them was where I built this Halloween cookie house blindfolded. And I also made a really pretty version, like almost exactly like this one. And then I smashed it with a can of beans. So I have another Halloween cookie house here. I don't know how we're gonna, you know, have fun with that, but it's not just gonna be a normal experience. I know that. Hopefully at Halloween Spirit today, we will encounter some more Halloween fun that I can take home and share with you. Give this video a thumbs up if you wanna see even more shopping trip videos, and let me know in the comments below what other sort of Halloween activities you'd like to see us do next. Most importantly, click that subscribe button so that you never miss new videos from me every week. And with that, I think we're ready to go shopping. What should we call this video? Halloween a go-go. Halloween a go go. Halloween a goo goo. Halloween a goo goo. This is Mission Control counting down for Halloween a goo goo in five, four, three, two, one. It doesn't say record. Yeah, no. the red dot. You guys haven't seen my new car yet, but I got it a couple weeks ago. Unless you follow me on Snapchat, then you might have seen it. But you're gonna see it when it's brand fresh, clean, and new. When did you get it washed? Friday. Ooh. My favorite Halloween costume of all time was in kindergarten. My mom had this cardboard box which she painted to look like a tub of popcorn and she glued popcorn to the top of it and to a hat that I had. I looked like the coolest kid in town. I couldn't fit through the doors. It was a hit. People loved it. We made it to Spirit of Halloween. Do you know who these guys are, Perry? Do you remember the movie Hocus Pocus? Oh, Hocus Pocus, Hocus yeah. Pocus. Oh, it's coming at you. Shall we start over here? Oh, face decal. Yeah, we're gonna get that. Little rat for the engine that could go. Bang, bang, cocking it, Batman rubbing it. So these are like kids' costumes, clearly. I think the most popular costumes of this year are gonna be Pennywise the Clown and what was it? A woman costume that I thought was gonna be really popular. Wonder Woman. Wonder Woman. The Freddy Krueger sweater. It's kind of cute though. You could wear that year round. It's like something you could just buy at Macy's. Torture things. Why is that scary? This is a swan skeleton. Why is it scary? Because it's not a swan, it's a skeleton of one. Ooh, a terror TV. Turn knob to try me. That genuinely got me, that one. Should we grab a basket? Toss it in. Score! This is my twin brother. His name is No Facey, Kevin Spacey. <laughs> so mystical. What if we just get like a cool light bulb for the background? This is an Edison bulb for the one that I keep breaking. And then for the small one, we can do the orange. So that's our first selection. Do they have an oh, orange? Nice. This room is gonna be sick. Ooh, you know I love it. Rainbow fingernails in case for Halloween you're being just gay pride. <gasps> I could do a skull thing, like a Dia de los Muertos. Yeah, you could. What do you guys think? Oh. I could even do that on top, don't you yeah. think? $7.99, works for me. What is your budget today, Nicole? Less than $30. <laughs> $3.99 for black and white face paint. Space Jam. Who remembers real monsters? Hi. <laughs> In light of today's like current events and things like that, I really recommend people don't walk around on Halloween with fake weapons. Yeah. 
I think we did a pretty good job here today. So we can start to celebrate Halloween in style. Nick D style. Make it funky. Disco party. Disco party. Halloween. Budget of $30. The grand total is $30.61. We went over budget again. <laughs> awesome. Thanks so much. Bye. A full $1 over budget. I could not be more happy. I'm it trying. Looks, oh. It looks like you're not looking well, because it's I honestly didn't think that I was going to make it and get everything for like around $30, but $31. Life is good. We'll meet you right back at home so we can at least decorate the room. <laughs> We are back from Spirit Halloween. I've been saying Spirit of Halloween. It's just Spirit Halloween. So we're back. Anyway, the first order of business is deciding which of these Halloween activities we will be doing next. I can either make the Halloween cookie house or do the Dia de los Muertos face painting. Or let me know in the comments below what other Halloween activities you'd like to see me pull off this month. What we can do right now, however, is replace my light bulbs in the apartment with these spooky Halloween light bulbs. Kona, who's the cutest dog? Oh, thank you. Thank you for that paw. Oh, she wants tummy rubs. Ah. So step one, we'll unbox this giant purple bulb. Unboxing. Hot. Okay, let's turn it on and see what we got. Yep, it's getting brighter. That's a real filament bulb, everybody, because it takes some time to get up there. Now for this lamp. I love orange lately, because it's the color of the season. Hot. Light bulbs are hot, remember that. Ha. What do you think of the room's spook factor so far? I gotta say, I really like the look of that orange one. This whole setup is getting towards Halloween. As time progresses, we will continue to ramp up the Halloween of it all. <laughs> what were your favorite Halloween purchases today and which of these activities would you like to see first? If you enjoyed this video, I would love it if you could give it a big thumbs up because it really helps me get it out there so that other people can see it too. But most importantly, if you're new to my channel, I would love to have you click that subscribe button. That way you can get new videos from me every week. It also lets me know that you're part of the Nick D crew that helps me put these videos together by letting me know what you want to see or taste or try next. So click that subscribe button. Thank you guys so much for watching and joining me and Perry for Halloween a goo goo. I'll see you next time.